tape really is in here. Wow. <laughs> the cape had its own little box. That's very special. There we go. The steering wheel is in and it's turning very well. Now these side parts are just going to pop in there. I hope the popping sounds of the Hi there. This evening I am doing a little casual unboxing slash Lego building video. And since Lego is quite noisy, and there's probably very um, snappy sounds to come, I have turned my mic around towards me. So it's more, it's not a voiceover, um, but it has a kind of voiceover vibe to it because the mic is so close to where I'm speaking and all the sounds of the unboxing and everything will be quite like not in the background but you know not as loud <laughs> not as intense okay so we have Lego number 76137 which is Batman the Riddler robbery. I have to say the Riddler is not my favorite Batman um, villain. And it's probably the one I know the least about, but the Batmobile is in this one. <laughs> um, I just saw this in Lidl, I think, just before Christmas when I was getting my son some Duplo from Lidl. Um, yeah, so I thought I'd just get it for a little unboxing and then I could add a little Batmobile to my Lego collection. <laughs> and at that point I was reading um, a really big um, Bat like Batman comics. It's like a big um, like album. Um, I think in English it's called The Hush. I think someone said that in the comments. Um, it's in French, so for me it's Le Silence, which is silent, so I guess it makes sense. It might be called Hush. So yeah, I was in a bit of a Batman um, time <laughs> just before Christmas. Okay, so how am I going to open this? It seems to be just I see how you open it now with your thumb right here. <laughs> okay, so we get two $100 bills or wad of bills. Maybe there's more than one. Batman, the Riddler, a skateboard, some dynamite, um, the Riddler's walking stick. Stick. Uh, we have, um, I think it's probably just one of those like Batman shaped throwing stars. Then we have the Batmobile, a cash machine. Um, yeah, it's like a little robbery scene where the Riddler's skateboarding off. And here is how you start. <laughs> this is how you build. So we have a bunch of stuff in here. We have a tiny little box and it looks like it has Batman's cape inside it or something. That's weird. Okay. Let's pull out the little leaflet first. There we have it. Um, we have the instructions online if we need it. <laughs> uh, do we have the instructions in here too? Yeah, we do. Okay. So let me pop out the 
this chunk of Batmobile right here and the very crinkly packages of Lego Okay, that's everything So I'm gonna just pop off and get some scissors, hold on Okay, I have the scissors, let's just go straight into both of these packages and just empty everything out because I don't think it's gonna get muddled up I'm wondering if this package is like doubles why are there separate packages? hmm, it doesn't look like a double completely no oh well I guess they're in separate packages because they're also available in different boxes maybe so it's cheaper that way okay so we need to start with Batman let's put Batman together okay here's his little leggies okay you can tell I have a two year old son because I just said his leggies <laughs> pop on his body then we need the cape so yeah I think the cape really is in here The cape had its own little box that's very special and the fabric is just like another Lego cape it's not fancier I wonder why they come in the little on the box so there we have his little cape on now we need his head oh no that's not him where's his head? Yeah, there we go. That's Batman's head. There we go. It makes him look a bit like a, a no-neck person <laughs> with the cape like that. Is my camera focusing? There you go. Yeah, it looks a bit no-neck like. Okay, now I need his mask. Kind of like a helmet here. Wow, Batman, he's looking good. Cool. Okay, so we did the first page. And the second page, wait, I'll just pop him here. The second page is constructing the Riddler. So here are his leggies <laughs> and his body. And then, does he have anything? No. we go and his little hat his polar hat with the question mark on it okay so that's the Riddler done what do we do next oh we just give him his cane see him escaping on that very well. Oh, Batmobile time. Okay, so we want to make him like that. So we take the first piece and we add the wheels. Here is our base, I guess. And then here are the wheels and the wheel inserts. Do they have a different way of going in? Specific to go in but I guess they'll have a specific side to go on yeah first wheels on it's very easy it does say four years and up on the box so I can't be too proud of myself
Do the third wheel. It's okay. There's four of you now. There we go. I popped in already. Let's see how it rolls. Very well. I would expect no less from the Batmobile. Okay. So now we've got two colored pieces to put in. Which is the front? Number seven is adding a nice bit on the front. Stage number eight is very cool. Okay, so stage number seven is adding this kind of bit, not at the front, at the back of the Batmobile. Is it on top of the blue? Yeah. Oh, that looks cool. Making it When did we add these pieces? Oh, I didn't realize on the page before we were supposed to add these too. So let's do that now. Put these at the front. Very cool. Very, very cool. Look at that. Beautiful Batmobile. So now we have this guy at the front. Let me just show you. We're going to put the, the bat signal on the front too. And then kind of grill at the front. So let's start with this guy here. Then the little bat signal at the front. Grill oh, upside down. Get it the right way, Jen. Pop that on there. And the little grills are here. There we go. Oh, he's kind of popped out a little. There we go. Make sure everything is nice.
some fire and okay <laughs> cool so the fire is coming out the back like so I would say like that and then the little throwing I want to say throwing bats so throwing stars or bat shaped throwing stars I know they're still called throwing stars if they're not in a star shape go onto these side bits they're held in so that you can use them when it needs to that's cool hmm. okay what's next oh we put batman in <laughs> okay and you get mr Cedric Diggory. <laughs> there we go. Okay, so Batman is looking pretty cool in his Batmobile there. It's lovely. <laughs> it's so cool. Okay, so we have the Riddler on his pretty pathetic mode of transport, let's face it, compared to Batman. <laughs> okay, now we're gonna build the cash dispenser a little base the second one we are going to build is using what? ah, this to make a little base for our cash dispenser and then on the side these little black pieces oh Knocking over the Riddler. Go. Go. That was a bit of a snap. Okay, the large sides coming in. And then some flashing. I want to say they're probably like light. don't really understand why they're on there. And I kind of backing. Um, then the little roof. <laughs> and then oh, I guess it's like a little safe part at the bottom. Oh, I like it when Lego have um, little bits like that where you can open it. So that part just open and closes like that actually clips in quite well. Where is it going to go? Oh, we put the money in the bank. <laughs> in the safe. Does it fit? It doesn't really fit well. It's going to kind of... Oh no, it fits perfectly. I guess it's not fully flat inside. Um, so the money goes in, but you can actually put it in and take it out of this part. <laughs> this guy goes on top. Here we go. I'm going to take the money out of the dispenser and try and use it to put money in. So yeah, you pop that inside. And I guess the reason <laughs> that the bottom part is not... Um, that it's slidey is so that you can remove it during a robbery. Yeah. So that can pop in there, but it's not stuck down, so you can slide it out to do the robbery. Okay, let's put the money in. We're making a deposit. Works. <laughs> okay, <laughs> my daughter's gonna love this. Make another deposit. 
made my deposits and we're going to add some dynamite to the side. Well, they've actually put it in the other direction, but I don't think that makes any difference. And that is us finished. We have our little bank getting robbed. I don't think he would be on the skateboard while he would have it beside him to like get away and Batman wouldn't be there yet so he'd come after the explosion you would need the explosion first of course okay so I am going to keep this like this and I'm gonna play with my daughter tomorrow <laughs> at bank robberies and we're gonna just probably I know what I'm gonna do I'm gonna get my Harry Potter Lego and I'm gonna make one of the Harry Potter characters make a deposit and then the Riddler's gonna try and steal it and Batman's gonna save them their money. <laughs> I think she'll like that. Okay, so here we go. This is the one that we made. It looks pretty good. I quite like it. I especially like Batman and his Batmobile. Say I would have bought it even without the whole Riddler side, but it's a nice little thing to add to your collection, and I'm sure my son will like to play with it too later on when he's a bit older. I really like the fact that the skateboard and the car roll really well, no problems. Good on you, Lego. Okay, <laughs> so I'm gonna leave this video here. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I really find these kind of random, like, casual chit-chatty videos relaxing, so I hope you guys like them. Um, Lego is such an accessible thing as well. Everybody likes Lego. I don't think I know anybody that doesn't like Lego. I mean, I know people that don't do Lego. <laughs> like, don't play with it because they're older or whatever, but, um, nobody says I don't even just to look at it. It's cool. So yeah. I hope that you found this relaxing and it has made you